Histoplasmosis, caused by the fungal species Histoplasma capsulatum, is a neglected tropical disease with a widespread global distribution. Histoplasma exists in the environment in a saprophytic mycelial form, but following host inoculation, undergoes a temperature-induced morphological transition to its pathogenic yeast form. Subsequent disease progression and dissemination is associated with host immunocompetence. Why is histoplasma important? In Kenya, despite recognition of histoplasmosis as a disease of national public health concern, the prevalence of histoplasma exposure in the general population and in variable community environments remains unknown. How did we address the paucity of research? This study examines the human seroprevalence of anti-histoplasma antibody and associations between seropositivity and demographic and environmental variables in rural Busia County, Western Kenya. Metadata and serum samples originated from a cross-sectional household survey previously conducted by the People, Animals and their Zoonoses project under an ULRI programme. A latex agglutination test was performed on 670 serum samples representing 178 households within 18 sublocations. Potential risk factors associated with histoplasma exposure were explored using multi-level logistic regression analysis. What were our research findings? A seroprevalence of 15.5% was measured. A multivariable logistic regression model was constructed which identified a statistically significant association between seropositivity and respondents reporting observation of rats within the household. The model identified two interaction terms associated with seropositivity. The first, reporting buildings constructed with mud walls and bats observed around the home, and also buildings constructed with mud walls and spring water collected as a water source. There was no evidence of associations due to clustering of seropositive samples at household nor sublocation level. What did we conclude? The seroprevalence results provide a baseline for sample size approximations for future epidemiologic studies of the burden of histoplasmosis in this region. The model identifies plausible risk factors for histoplasma capsulatum exposure in Busia County that warrant further investigation. Future research should examine the associations identified here and consider how health, demographic and socioeconomic factors impact on histoplasma transmission at the human-animal environment interface. Thank you for listening.